Good evening, everyone. This is Barry Beer with you on Thursday evening, the 21st of May, and thank you for joining me here in the studio. The time is coming up to 6.30 Thursday night, a cold night, and the rain did come today, and there's plenty more rain coming tomorrow. Well, Sydney's top temperature tomorrow will be 16 degrees, which is telling us that winter is well and truly knocking on the door. Now, you may recall I did a video on what to do in preparation for winter, and I'm right to touch on a few basic tips for the winter months. Now, the first tip is rug up if you are going outside and make sure that you have enough clothing on, not shorts and t-shirt, because I can tell you viewers, if you are not dressed warming for the winter months, well, I can tell you, you can come down with pneumonia and quite serious pneumonia too. So, if you are going outside, guys, make sure that you dress warmly and comfortably and appropriately for the winter months and make sure that you have a beanie to keep your head warm. Step two, make sure that you eat nice warm foods like casseroles, porridge, soups, um, hot toasted sandwiches, wraps, um, roast dinners, that sort of thing and a barbecue, but make sure it is fine weather for a barbecue. Well, unfortunately, guys, it is not going to be a sunny day tomorrow. It is going to, it is going to rain cats and dogs, and just recapping the temperatures once again, Sydney will be very cold tonight and the top temperature tomorrow of only 16 degrees and the forecast for the next couple of days I can tell you pretty wet so pretty yucky tomorrow so like I just said winter is definitely knocking on the door. Now, step two, and step three, sorry, if you are unwell, do not come to work if you have cold or flu-like symptoms. Stay rugged up in your bed with a good novel or good cooking book, and have CDs ready or DVDs if you are watching television in bed like I would do if I was sick and cancel any plans you have made well you can't make any plans at the moment because not all the restrictions have been lifted I am told that some more stri restrictions will be lifted by June 1. And another rule, guys, um, stay away from people who have already got the cold or who may have a cold. And go to the doctors if your symptoms get worse. He or she may be able to give you 
a script for what you've got and drink plenty of food, you guys. Okay, and going back to the foods, I forgot to mention the soups. Now, soups are very warming for the winter months and make a big batch of it too. And uh, going back to keeping germs to yourself, okay, uh, um, stay away from people like I've just mentioned, okay, and, uh, and stay in bed for a couple of days until you feel that you are more alive and dim, okay? And uh, another thing, please um, don't spread your germs around, keep them at bay, and if you are going to cough, cover your mouth, and please do not use the same tissue to blow your nose because it is disgusting and unhygienic. And, and if you've got a sore throat, guys, mix up some hot water with some lemon juice and honey, okay? And if you have a fever, you can take some lemon now. Lamb tip has paracetamol in it. Check with your doctor on how much you should be taking or the pharmacist. And another thing, get a flu shot. It may, it may not be too late. So next time you are at the doctor's, either ask him or her to give you a flu jab and make sure that you've got plenty of VIX on hand so that if you or your family um, are very congested and got mucus on your chest, get someone to rub some VIX on your chest, okay, and take your temperature as well and make sure that you drink plenty of water, guys, and plenty of orange juice to keep your vitamin in C intake up because it is very important. And eat plenty of fresh, healthy fruit and vegetables too. Make a fruit and vegetable juice to keep you fluid up. And the breakfast, have a nice warm bowl of porridge with some golden syrup and chia seeds to start the day. And at lunch, why not have some hot soup and serve with um, a couple of toasted sandwiches with your favorite topping. It is very important to look after your health when winter has arrived, especially during the lockdown. So what I would like to say to you viewers out there tonight watching my YouTube channel and video on winter. Please look after your health and take care of the family's health. And if you are concerned about your health, make sure that you make an appointment with the doctor and have a conversation with the doctor on the phone if you can't get to the surgery. And have a nice warm shower so that you can get rid of 
any body aches and pains, okay, and and then climb back head to bed and get plenty of rest for a few days and call into work and tell them that you will not be coming in due to sickness. And like I've said, cancel any plans you have made well. There's no point in me telling you to because we're still in lockdown at the moment. But one thing I would like to suggest is have plenty of face masks handy, okay, and plenty of cough mixture and some Vicks, okay, and plenty of fresh lemons and oranges Okay, plenty of fresh fruit and veggies because you need to keep your strength up if you are sick and if you feel like you've got a temperature, phone the doctor straight away. I hope this video uh, tonight that I have, have get um, I hope this video tonight that I have presented for you will help you to stay healthy and encourage you to stay healthy. And don't stand outside in the breeze or in the cold wind for too long because that's how you will catch a cold very quickly. And especially if you had not got enough clothes on. So please guys, the message that I would like to close the show with tonight is don't just dress up in shirts and shorts and thongs. Rug up well. Dress up well. Rug up. Rug up well. If you if you are going outside in the, if you are going outside in the rain, please have a rain jacket with you or a raincoat or umbrella. And if you have clients in a electric wheelchair, if it's raining heavily, please in, don't encourage them. To go out in the rain without um, protecting their wheelchair or themselves. And this is where I'd like to, this is where I'd like to close the show tonight by saying stay dry, stay well, look after each other, look after your family if you or they are sick and cancel your shift if you are not well enough to come to work. Phone at least 24 to 48 hours prior to your shift so that the manager can cover your shift. And that's a wrap, guys. I'm Barry Fair. Have a great night, and I will talk to you tomorrow. And like I said at the beginning of the show tonight, the rain is coming, so keep that brawling handy, guys. And if you need to take the clients anywhere, make sure. To close my program tonight, just going over some of the things I've talked about in preparation for winter. And just one more thing, make sure that you've got a good car battery as well on the, when you go and start your car in the morning. So make sure that you 
check that your battery's good, and 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 make sure that your car will stop. And this is where I'd like to conclude my birthday wrap tonight. The time is coming up to ten minutes before seven o'clock. Um, thanks for joining me here this evening in the studio, and I look forward to talking with you in the morning. But like I said at the beginning of the show tonight, the rain is coming and there's plenty of, of it. So stay warm, stay rugged up, okay? Look after each other. Don't get angry if things aren't going your way during the lockdown. And we are nearing the end of week eight of the lockdown. Two months at home. We know it's been a long road, guys, but hey, there is uh, the end of the lockdown in sight. And I will tell you about it at the, on the next video. But that's all I've got to share with you tonight. Thanks for your company on the show, and I look forward to chatting with you in the morning. But from all of us here now at Oceana House, a very good night to you, and and I look forward to you joining me sometime during tomorrow. And remember, have a good positive mental attitude, guys, because that's a way to go during this lockdown. And that's where I'd like to, to say a very good night to you now, okay? And ring my point if you are in trouble. Uh, the number um, for my point, guys, is one three double one. One four, get a pen and paper and write that number down because you never know, you may need to ring white wine one day. So, on that note, guys, it's time for me to say good night to you now at 10 minutes before 7 o'clock and thank you for your company today on my two videos. This is Barry Fair and all the team here at Oceana House wishing you a very pleasant and safe night. Good night everybody. Good night Oceana. Good night Australia. Good night. <laughs>